Want to keep up with the latest Gary Plays videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. Yo, yo, people, get you in here for another video. So, guys, in this video, we are going to be doing two different rescues. One is a bit of a smaller one, um, and we're probably going to use this new vehicle for it, which we'll be going over more shortly here. Um, but yeah, so that's going to be pretty cool. It's a, it's a smaller rescue. A vehicle just got stuck. And then the other one uh, that we're going to be doing is a vehicle that got fully submerged in water, which that one, we're, yeah, we're, we're going to need to figure out what machinery we have um, to rescue that thing. I uh, haven't even gone over and assessed the damage yet, so we'll see. But either way, guys, before we get into all that, I'm really looking forward to it. But here is a message from our sponsor. Do you want to make money when you're sleeping? Salad is a PC app that allows you to make real money at the push of a button. Salad is a mining app that aims to be the safest and easiest way to monetize your PC's idle resources. Salad uses your computer's GPU to mine Ethereum, similar to how Bitcoins are mined. This does, however, have a few tech requirements. The main requirement is that your GPU has at least 4 GB of VRAM. I have some good news for you. The PC app is easy to download. Simply click the link provided in the description below, download Salad, run the automatic installer, and then click the green start button. After running the app, you can choose what reward you would like to receive. Some of the options are from Amazon gift cards, Xbox gift cards, Steam gift cards, Discord Nitro, purchase games, and even receive physical rewards such as a NVIDIA RTX 2080 Ti. Salad has been generous in providing the GearPlays community with an additional $2 sign-up bonus after running the program for 12 hours. Make sure to enter code GP when signing up to receive the bonus. Okay guys, so there we go. Um, yeah, you guys see there is two vehicles in this lineup to look out of place. Obviously, one of them is this one, um, but this has the same branding and everything, and it's just for a different purpose, right? Um... And then you see all these tow trucks are the same colors, but then you see this thing. Now, um, I want to say I actually I saw a picture of this on Facebook um, a little bit before it was released, and I I started talking to the modern stuff. He's a pretty cool guy, but yeah. Either way, we got talking, and uh, I I didn't get the mod earlier or anything, but just want to say made by made by a solid person, um, which I I always like when. Modders are pretty chill, and they're honest, and they're just kind of polite and nice. So, shout out to him. Uh, his name and everything will be on my website. Same with all the mods found in this video that are public will be found on my website. Um, speaking of this map, actually, well, here, let's start driving. But um, speaking of, like, the map, the mods and stuff, uh, this map. So, here is the thing with this map. So, it's called Wind Chaser. Now... This mod is made by Anthony uh, Rowick, I think his last name. I think that's what they say. It's made by Anthony uh, and Expendables Modding. So, it's currently not public. Uh, at least no one's told me it's public. And I, I haven't, I really haven't heard much from it. Um, the squad helped me get access to this map, but I've, I've not heard much beyond that. But either way, this mod hopefully one day will become uh, fully public. I know there's some kind of version of the map that is out there, but... It's quite different from the one we're currently sitting on. Uh, but either way, looking forward for when you guys can get your hands on it. But until then, just a shout out to the mod makers. Um, of, obviously, you guys know Spend was modding. They they do a pretty pretty good job with their with creating their mods, and I'm really happy um, to have good contacts with lots of the guys over there because they, they work quite hard. So thank you. Expandables modding, Anthony, all of you guys, solid, solid job. But either way, guys, so let's let's take a closer look at this vehicle. Now, I don't know where this vehicle is based off of. It's clearly not anywhere in North America. I can judge from where, where the license plate is and stuff. I'm going to assume, like, maybe Germany or, um, yeah, I'm, I'm really thinking it's, like, German. I could be wrong, but German, I'm getting kind of that vibe maybe like from like the uk i guys i'm honestly not too familiar with how like the license plates look in like um in like the uk versus in germany i always kind of just get the two confused i i, I do believe they look uh, kind of similar M maybe i'm wrong who knows but i'm just kind of basing off the way the words look and, like the words made me think it's german right like that that looks german to me uh but this front license plate I feel like we've seen 
like British vehicles like that. So, I don't or European vehicles, I should say. My bad. Should not say British. European vehicles. I'm gonna hear about that in the comments. But anyways, let's just keep going. Oh, there's a soccer. F I somehow we've drove past it this many times. I've never realized that, that soccer field's there. Also, also, I gotta say something. That red building over there. You guys, you guys got a little bit mad at me for not showing it last video. And here's the thing, okay? When we go past it, I'll tell you guys the thing. I, I, I didn't want to say it quite yet. But that red building, I know you guys are so curious on what's in there. Um, I, 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 I do get that. I do get that. But, oh, Applebee's. Pretty cool. Have you guys ever been to Applebee's? Burger King? I've been to Burger King. I think I've been to Applebee's. Um, we had this red building over here, guys. The, the, this... This red building, I didn't expect so many people to care about it, but a lot of a lot of people do. A lot of people do, um, and I know a lot of people wonder what's inside it. And again, the thing is, I could show you what's inside it, but at the same time, I could also look this way and not show you what's inside it. So I think we're gonna go with that. Now, if guys, you know what? Here, if you guys want me to show you what's inside that building. Just because, I, guys, I, I know I, I made some people mad last, uh, last time we were on here because I didn't show you guys it. But if you guys want to see what's inside, I'm just going to go big, okay? And I, I highly doubt we're going to hit this. Um, but who knows? Who knows? 400 likes. Let's just do it. 400 likes will show you. I, most videos average around 100 likes on the channel. So I feel like 400 is pushing it. But if this can get to 400 likes then I will show you guys what is inside that red building. So, yeah, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and here's a vehicle. As I said, it's nothing bad. Uh, this this vehicle we're driving has a winch on it, so that's why I decided to take this because um, we I don't think we need a heavy tow truck or any kind of heavy machinery for this one. It literally is just a small vehicle. It slid. I don't know how. Maybe it was raining. It's obviously quite old it's probably been sitting for a while but what we're gonna do guys is we are going to load it up and which also means we need to get a tow hook on there so tow hook go on the ground please don't fall through thank you okay these tow hooks they have caused so many issues in the past okay stay there let's hop in here attach perfect and yeah you see it's literally stuck on this like little barrier thing kind of cool Look at this third person mod, guys. Um, but yeah, it's just kind of stuck, so nothing too big here. I said the first job would be kind of small. So, here we go. Okay, and we're just going to attach like that. And honestly, I think we align pretty well. Is there any kind of... Oh, yeah, there we go. Well, I don't know how useful those are, but... What are these? Oh, those top ones do work. Okay, we'll, we'll turn them all on, I guess. And then turn on the vehicle and we should just be able to start winching this in yeah so it's obviously going to be getting scraped here quite a bit that's why we're talking oh look at that wheels suspension that is being destroyed right there look at that okay we're starting to get a bigger gap again but that that was not looking too good this vehicle has definitely been saving too long we're just going to tow it um i must they, they the owners have not told us to scrap it but looking at it don't think they care for this thing to be repaired um so yeah i'll i'll talk more with the owners they they've not been responding to my emails the last email we had they just said to get this vehicle out of there um and yeah so that's that's what we're doing they've actually already paid for it too to be removed from here so we're we're doing pretty good there we go okay so what we want to do detach reattach We'll pull that in just a little. Hopefully that's good. Now, again, I don't think this this thing doesn't really strap down. The tow hook should be strapped down there. But it's going to throw down all these straps just in case. By the way, just a shout out or just a thing I want to mention. Anyone who's watching this video who's a modder. If you are a modder who knows how to, who, like someone who I could contact and you could most of the time quickly add the ability uh, just I all, all I need is a modder to add in straps like a vehicle to be able to be strapped down It doesn't need to have a visual it literally could be like right here Just straps down or maybe just the wheels strapped down 
um, or ideally, ideally the ends of it strapped down. I don't know. If so, if there's anyone out there who knows how to add that to a mod, uh, and could, and I could, you think I could contact you occasionally to help me out? I would greatly appreciate it. I have reached out to some modders. I think we might have someone who's able to help, but um, obviously we have a lot of mods in the game, and they might not always be available. So if if we could have like a few modders maybe. Uh, ready to go for that. That'd be pretty cool. So I, I, I haven't even, like, I haven't reached out to Lambo. I know Lambo knows how to do it. Um, but obviously, he's quite busy. And lots of other people, too. So, by the way, it's right now, I know we're driving the wrong way. Uh, it's actually the right way, because I want to see the other vehicle we'll be rescuing, because it's right over here. Um, okay. I don't see it yet. It show oh, jeez. This vehicle is... This vehicle is moving by. Yeah, like if this front was strapped down, that would be nice. Uh, oh, okay, I see it. Uh, let's go swimming. Oh my god. What is this truck? I kind of like it. I do kind of like it, but very unique. Uh, how long has it been sitting here? It is dirty. It's it's pretty scratched up. It's not too bad. Okay, that is scratched up. But honestly, maybe, maybe it hasn't been here a while. It's just muddy when it went in. Um, okay, how are we gonna... I don't think bringing it over top of the bridge makes sense. Maybe. Maybe just for fun. I don't know how heavy this vehicle is. But if we could maybe just kind of... We could park up a vehicle here. Maybe one of our heavy wreckers. Extend the arm out. Pull it this way. And then pull a the vehicle like this. So, by that, by that I mean... We'll grab... We'll have a tow hook. The vehicle will pull this way. Because our arm will be extended out. And then we'll... Uh, m stop and then start turning it this way. I think that should be good. So let's go ahead, guys. Let's drive on back. And you know what, guys? When I'm dri oh, jeez. Um, when I'm driving back, I'm gonna fix this issue, and I'm also uh gonna gonna throw in a message from our sponsor. So let's go. Join Lambo Mod's Patreon page to instantly receive access to some amazing modding creations. You will get early access to Lambo, Winston, and Beardshot's awesome ideas. On top of all that, you will get cool textures and other unique modding tools. Join today using the link below. Okay guys, so I got this over here. It actually took quite a while. I I, I don't know why. I really don't know why because I felt like we got over to the location pretty quick, but... Yeah, I don't know, we got it over here, so I'm just going to leave this loaded up for now. I don't think we're going to be using this vehicle again today. I could just because I don't think that um, that big truck would even fit on here. It, mi it might, it honestly might, but we're just going to leave this for now. Until we know what's happening with that, there's really no point to unload it, because if I unload it at the shop and it's just going to be scrapped, it's just going to cost us money to move, so better keep it loaded up for now. Um, okay, this vehicle needs to... Needs to back up it it didn't get the program there um but yeah anyways so we have all of our different records now in here and again these were made by wood metal farms so i'm thinking we're gonna need we're gonna need either we'll take either this one uh the hr 150 or uh i think this is a 50 ton one yeah it is so this arm doesn't go sideways um yeah, it just goes up and down. So I don't think we'll take that one. But so we can either go with this one or we can go with the Canadian one uh, or or this one. Actually, what's what even is this one? HR 151. Actually, 151. So it's a higher number, which makes me think maybe it's better. What number is this one? Oh, this is 251. OK, well, the 251 sounds even better. The 251 has the front wheels there. OK, you know what? Let's just take this one. I know we don't ever use this one. The arm rotates, goes up and down. That's all that matters. So, yeah, let's get going. We can honk the horn. And there we go. So, I'm just going to dive this out. I'm going to leave these gates open because when I came back, um, like when we just came back, when you guys were watching the sponsored message, uh, I actually had that bug where you couldn't open the gates. So, I had a. It, it, it was a mess. It, I know how to fix that issue when it happens but it's just it's just challenging so it's better to just not close them obviously there's no one on here so nothing will get stolen um but yeah we'll, we'll just leave them open i know it's not the most realistic just because it's like 
safety reasons, I guess. But I don't know. It's all good. So I think, oh, we actually, okay, we did go the wrong way, but I know how to get there from here. Or actually, here, you know what? Let's cut through the field. Why not? Sorry, crops. It's actually, they aren't being destroyed. I just don't want to show you guys what's in that building. Um, and honestly, I know you guys don't care much for the driving back and forth when you're watching these. So, yeah. But, guys, that red building. What did I say? 400 likes? Guys, honestly, I, 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 I don't think we can get that much. But we'll see. We'll see. Okay. Here we go. So, um... Okay, everything's looking pretty good so far. Yeah, guys, honestly, it's kind of good but weird when videos go as planned. This video took a while to set up, so I was hoping it would go as planned. But, yeah, I, I always expect there to be at least some issues. But so far, everything's everything's going the way I was hoping for it to. And I, I don't want to jinx that. I do not want to. Okay, hold up. We kind of forgot a tow hook. Or, no, no, there's a tow hook attached to this. I just don't know how to take this one off. Here, let's go, let's stay on this bridge area. Um, okay, I think, uh, here, wait, let's lower this down. I think, go like this. Yes, okay, perfect. Now, the hardest part of this all, once we get this done, we'll be chilling. Uh, here, let's, let's just, just to be safe, okay, I'm going to save the game. Just because if this falls through the ground, I'm going to be mad. Okay, here we go. This is our only tow hook. We need to start bringing extra with us. I don't know why I forgot. Um, okay, yes. Yeah, so right down here. Let's go under. Hold our breath. Three, two, one. I don't know why I actually held my breath there. That's kind of funny. I hope at least one of you guys did too. Um, but yeah. Anyways, let's go ahead. And I'm guessing at least someone thought the audio just cut out when I didn't talk there. They were like, oh, his mic broke. But no, no. I just, I held my breath. I was weird. <laughs> okay. Let's go ahead. Can you guys tell I'm recording this at night, by the way? I, I find that the things I talk about in videos are very different depending on the time of day I record it. I record in the morning. Everything makes sense. It's all kind of proper. When I record at night. Some of the things I talk about are so random, so weird. But it's kind of fun. It is kind of fun. Okay. Are those... Oh, jeez. Um. Okay, not, not exactly what I was expecting there. Can we... Let's try to drive a bit forward. Actually, you know what? It's, it's because of this being raised here. Worst comes to worst, all that's going to happen is, like, obviously these can support the weight of this vehicle, the meant to. But when we start pulling, it should bring this back end down. Uh, so, yeah, let's go ahead and, oh, geez, it, this is, this is kind of weird. Uh, we'll bring out that arm as much as we can. I was hoping it would go further. I don't know why I thought it would. Um, yeah, we'll just see how this goes. It's not going to go as smoothly as we planned, but... Okay, there we go. Um, Yeah, I think let's just start pulling it. I don't know. If you enjoy, drop a like. I feel like I have to say that. I think I've already mentioned likes, though. So, I don't know. Either way. So yeah, you see it's bringing us... Bringing our back down again. Yeah, okay. We're staying good there. It's just going to work. I'm not going to hold my breath this time. Um, Oh, yeah. This thing is having no issues with this. So, this truck, guys, I think it was from some mod contest thing. Um, what does that say? Sc is that a B or R? Scar Scrox? Scabock? I don't know what that says because it's kind of... Oh, uh, Scarock. I think that's how you say it. I don't know. You guys know I'm bad with names. It doesn't matter if it's a person's name or if it's a car company. I, I, don't know, I, I think it's a made-up car company, though. If I'm wrong, my apologies. Um, I'm, I'm hoping it's not from North America because if so then I, I apologize for not knowing it since I live in North America um, okay we're doing good here I want to I don't I don't want to be pulling it at this angle so we're gonna just like this gonna lower down 
and we can even bring our arm in i'm thinking yeah i think that that's gonna give us just a better angle so let's start pulling again and again our, our vehicle we are getting sideways uh, no well kind of but it's okay yeah that angle looks like it's gonna be a bit better there we go okay let's go over this i feel like in your life you would never do that because i know if these cables snap they can literally kill someone or at least i think they can if i'm if I, I i know when they snap it's very very dangerous i'm pretty sure they have the power to, to kill someone so we obviously don't want that to happen i wonder if this video is going to be de demonetized just because i killed said killed someone i don't know hopefully it's not anyways <laughs> i need to stop recording at night guys I, s I know some of you guys enjoy when i record at night but i'm, I'm kind of goofy kind of goofy when recording at night um okay are we yeah okay we're good let's go ahead bring that in and let's pull forward there we go oh yeah okay so this vehicle has like i it literally feels like there's nothing attached to this just because of how powerful it is i like literally when i'm driving this it's driving like normal it's kind of weird um okay maybe we'll just go back with this now this tow bar this vehicle doesn't have that like strap down mechanism thing we're still yet to use that there's very few vehicles that can do this but uh some of the wood metal farm vehicles you can actually uh strap down using that using that like bar that you see at the end here but for now what we'll do is just kind of raise it up i'm thinking like that let's pull it in a bit more maybe okay there we go and then uh yeah i think that should be good let's see oh geez okay yeah keep that in it's i it might be making it harder to drive yeah why is this getting harder to drive now what if we go like that oh there we go that's kind of good yeah it's definitely not strapping down but i'm happy with that here we go so let's just drive back like this the vehicle is definitely raised a lot but wow this is actually kind of cool wow i really like that guys we got that at a good angle you know what Let, let's save the game right here I, I might get a screenshot later from here he he <laughs> okay come on save game there we go and yeah let's keep driving also i just realized we never turned on our lights during that like our our, our hazards but we'll, we'll kind of keep those on now i think we're allowed to I, some comments have told me that we can. Some have told me we're not allowed to keep those on. I feel like when we have a vehicle being towed, we are allowed to. But we just don't have the right of way. Like, I think we're just treated as a normal vehicle. It's just kind of for caution. But again, I, I, I could very well be wrong about that one. Anyways, let's just keep going. I wonder if this vehicle would start up. It does look like it's kind of designed for off-road, but... Obviously, it was somewhere okay. It, it definitely won't start up, but maybe the battery will still be okay on it. I don't know. Probably not. Here, you know what? Let's just see. I just want to turn on the hazards. Um, there we go. Those work. Kind of. In I yeah. You, I don't think this is based off a real vehicle because there's no way a vehicle has those shape of lights. Like in real life. And if one does, then it's very, very unique to say the very least. Um, yeah, let's keep going. Also, I'm very happy that we can go this speed. Also, yes, I, I, I know we're coming up on that building. I, I will look this way. Don't worry. You can't even see anything through the windows. like. But, yeah, I, I, I want to keep it hidden, guys. I, I, I want to keep it hidden. Just, just because I know it bugs you guys so much. Like, it caught me off guard, the amount of people who want it. Like, I'm pretty sure, I think three people sent me messages on Discord. And were like, okay, I know you said you wanted to show it in the video. But can you just send me a screenshot of what's in there? I'm like, no. Like, just, just, just no. 
But guys, 400 likes, may, maybe maybe we'll show it. Maybe we will show it. But if, if we have 400 likes, we'll definitely show it. But the thing is, I don't know if we can get 400 likes. 400 likes is a lot to ask. Maybe maybe we can do it. Okay, you know what? 400 likes or if 400 unique people comment on the video. So 400 different comments, which I think that's going to be harder to get than 400 likes. But just just to up the chances of um, us, of you guys being able to see what's in there. Let's say that. So if there's either uh, and or, so if there's 400 likes or 400 unique comments, like different people commenting. That, that, I think that would be pretty cool. So let's turn. I feel like you guys are all just going to get on like alt accounts then. Let's turn here. There we go. And actually, I don't even know if we've ever had a video get 400 comments. I, I know we've had a video at 100 comments. I don't even know if it was like 100 unique people though, but it might have just been lots of people talking. Uh, I, like, I, know, I know we've gotten 100 before, but 400. I can't remember any video that is like that maybe that I got hit by a car video the first one like the the one where I talked about me getting hit by a car um, and like explaining it all I think that would be the only video that might get close just because I got a lot of comments mainly because the squad and Spencer TV did mention it in their videos um, but yeah anyways so we are here, guys. Thank you for watching. I'm just going to leave that kind of parked up there just because it looks kind of cool. Um, but yeah, guys, this this thing, hopefully we can actually repair this. We probably won't scrap it because it, it looks kind of good. Like, clean it up. The the paint, like, it's not rusty. It's just the paint's worn out, so, like, scratched up. So, I don't know. We can look into repairing this vehicle. I think it might be salvageable just because it was also built for off-road. Uh, or at least it looks like that. So we'll see. Anyways, thanks for watching. You guys are awesome. Bye bye. Want to play games with your friends? Grab a dedicated server from G Portal. Make sure to click the link down below to receive an instant 5% discount.